Hey party people, Perfectly Elena, Perfectly Posh, aka Elena Hurt. I'm going to show you how I use my favorite products. Now I love Posh and I don't just sell it, I live it. But I'm not going to bore you by showing you my vast amount of products and, that I use and have. I'm just going to stick to the top six products that I use on a daily basis during my routine. So first up, Complexion Perfection. This is an exfoliating daily face wash. It is, actually I'm going to wet my face first. So this is a gentle cleanser that deep cleans using peppermint essential oils. And it also has, if you can see those little kind of dots in there, those are finely ground walnut shells. That is the exfoliating agent in this product. No harmful plastic microbeads, yay, which were banned, finally. So this is scrubbing and exfoliating the dead skin cells from the surface of my skin. So it's going to help effectively receive moisture into the skin when I'm done which is what we all want, clean skin that gets the good oils in from our moisturizer. Now, if you're in a hurry, you can just rinse this off and apply your moisturizer. But if you have a minute, say you need to brush your teeth, you could go ahead and brush your teeth while you apply one of my favorites. Okay. Pore reducing spot treatment mask. I'm shrinking. Now I like to apply this with a clean makeup brush. I don't actually use it to apply makeup, just my masks. And I clean it in between each use. This helps to apply just a thin layer over the skin. Anything more than a thin layer isn't actually going to be doing anything. You're just wasting your product and your money. Nobody likes that. Just a helpful tip. So you just want to apply this to the spots where you have large pores, not all over your face. And you can use this daily. Actually recommends it on the bottle to be most effective. So you can brush your teeth, then rinse it off, but since I have a minute or two, I'm going to share with you my favorite lotion. Hey honey, your skin needs to be healed, soothed, and moisturized. Now, this uses honey, a natural humectant. That means it attracts water to the skin and it retains it. So helps you retain all that good moisturizer into, or the good moisture into your skin. So I usually apply this after I've showered, um, but I sometimes I apply it honestly without even showering too, but that's just when I feel it's most effective because it's gonna retain all that water that you just soaked into your skin during your shower. So it also has um, anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, and anti-aging properties in the honey that is in the product, plus it's antimicrobial and absorbs impurities. Pretty amazing. So the healing powers aren't just great for me, but they're also great for my babies. It's gentle enough for my newborn, but it's tough enough even for my toddler's eczema, and he hasn't had an outbreak in months, which is pretty amazing. So now let's go ahead and rinse this mask off. Okay, it doesn't take that long. Rinse, rinse, rinse. Now don't be alarmed if your face gets a tad red after applying a face mask. This is normal. The product is drawing the blood cells to the surface of your skin, making it appear red, and it will disappear over time. This one tends to disappear pretty quickly. By the time I put on my makeup, you can't even tell that my skin is red. Um, and if not, my makeup covers it. So, side note, 
before you go ahead and apply what I'm going to apply next, which is my moisturizer, you want to add any eye creams or serums that you have or topical treatments like anti-acne um, medications to your skin because the, adding the moisturizer last is actually going to lock in those active ingredients and make it more effective in repairing your skin. So I love, love, love Moisturize 911. This is a moisturizer made with caffeine. I like to use a little bit more than a pea size amount because I'm actually gonna apply it to my face as well as my neck. So I get a little bit more just to go that much farther. Now this also reduces puffiness under the eyes as well and like I said that caffeine just tightens your skin but it also uses essential orange oil to brighten your skin so tighten and brighten all in one product and I love the orange citrus scent that the orange essential oils give it it smells so amazing oh it's so good so now that I've applied that I normally tend to go straight to my makeup routine. Now, for the sake of this video, I'm not gonna go and show you my whole makeup routine, but I'm gonna show you one tidbit. I actually like to start my makeup routine with a lip balm. Right now I'm using, all you need is Vanilla Love, really big moisturizing lip balm. Our lip balms are made with shea butter. Mm, super, super moisturizing, oh, you can see that. Mm just so good and this way if by doing this before I paint my face and my eyes I'm actually priming my lips with that shea butter it's just absorbing it all in so it's nice soft and supple to receive any color or lip gloss that I'm going to apply last after I do my makeup so assuming I did my makeup I'm moving on to my hair now I use End Mend Fix Spritz. This just gets sprayed onto the ends of your hair. You want to spray about a foot away, concentrating on just the ends of your hair. It has argan oil, shea oil, and mango seed butter to help heal and add shine to your hair. And the carabees actually repair damage like right before your eyes. You can see like split ends come together and kind of, I don't want to say disappear, but um, heals them. <laughs> it's pretty amazing. So you don't have to skip your heat. Go ahead and use your blow dryer or your straightener and it actually activates the carabees and helps even like lock in those split ends and kind of takes care of those even more than just spraying it on and kind of going. But it's really great just for styling. It smells great and actually helps with flyaways, which I kind of have going on in my roots. So I sometimes, even though this is concentrated on the ends, I put a little bit just to the tippy top of my hair to kind of help with those flyaways. But that's it, there you have it. Those are my top six favorite products. I hope you guys had fun and enjoyed watching this video. Maybe you learned a trick or two. And next up, retail therapy. Ah.